Hi my loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be doing middle splits, okay? So one, you should be warm. If you're not, it's all right. Uh, we can warm up together. But ideally, if you're even warm before this, it'll be great. Um, because I'm a dancer, I'm going to incorporate dance moves as well and uh, some yoga asanas also to help uh, make this a little better. What I want you to remember is that this is going to be an intermediate to an advanced series. So even if you're beginners, you can still do this because I will give you variations. Uh, but try and follow along also, okay? So the first thing we're going to be doing is goddess posture. You're going to turn your feet out, you're going to open. Now as you do this, there are things I want you to remember. I do not want you to, uh, when you're going into this, you do not want to arch the back. Can you see? This is arching the back. You don't want to do this. You want to take the tailbone in, push the knees back. Okay. So all we're going to do is basically that. I think in uh, fitness it's called sumo split. Uh, sumo? Squat. I think that's what it's called. Inhale, <laughs> exhale. Inhale, you're going to take your hands up. As you take your hands up, whoop, over and up. From the inhale, exhaling, you're going to push down. As you push down, the knees do not come in. The knees go back. Your pelvis wants to come forward. You come up. One. And up. Squeeze the thighs together. And up. And up. Don't arch the back. Don't let the chest come up. Six. And up. Seven. And up. Eight. And up. Nine. And up. Last one. Ten. We're going to stay. As we stay, breathe. Ten. Breathe. Nine. Eight. Drop the chest down. Take the tailbone in. Keep pushing the knees. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Keep going. Three, two, one. You're gonna come up. As you come up, gonna turn in the feet. As you turn in, exhaling, push, bend forward, relax wherever you are. It doesn't matter. Just stay relaxed. So even if you're here, stay and relax. If you're down, stay wherever. Eight, seven, six. Make sure your weight is not only on the outer edges of the feet. Make sure it's inside as well. Three. Two, one. All we're going to do is we're just going to move the hip, okay? So you're moving the hip side to side because we are opening up the hamstring and inner thighs. Three, boom, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax. You're going to turn out the right foot. As you turn out the right foot, I'm going to drop down to the right side. As I drop, my left leg is going to come in. As I come in, so unless you have a 180 split, then you can take this back. Okay, otherwise there's going to be pressure coming onto your knee. Otherwise, get the leg forward. Keep taking the knee, push the knee. Stay 10. Try and straighten the spine. Don't sink in right now. 8, 7, 6. Five, three, two, one. We're going to go to the opposite side. You're going to pass through the goddess posture. Yeah, pass through. Leg comes forward side. Keep pushing the knee back. Stay ten. Nine. Keep breathing. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One level one, you can take your hand to the side and place level one. Level two, you're going to take your hand up and down. Now, when you're doing this, remember your knees want to go out, your knees do not want to come in because if you're going to be doing this, there's going to be pain and pressure coming onto your knees. So, whichever level you're comfortable, relax and do it with me. Inhale, inhale, and go one and side. And three and set four five six <laughs> seven breathe with me eight nine ten last one we're going to stay as we stay all we're going to do is going to get the forearms on the floor as much as you can flex the opposite leg so even if you're here try and get it down one as much as you can 
seven. Keep pushing this thigh out. Five, four. Breathe with me. Three, two, one. Again, through malasana. As we come, turn the foot. Keep pushing the knees out. Remember, don't get this inside. If the heel or the ankle cannot come on the floor, keep it up. No worries. Stay ten as much as you can. Nine, eight, seven, five, four, three, two. One. From here, we're going to go into Malasana. So you're going to drop the left foot down, come forward, in. As you come in, get the foot slightly inside and out. Turn in and out. Parallel, just stretch five, almost four, three, two, one. From here, you're going to turn out the feet. As you turn out the feet, we're going to come back down. Oh my God, my inner thighs are already on fire. Inhale, exhale. You're going to take your left hand. Um, so your right shoulder is going to come down. Left hand to the left thigh. Inhale, exhale, push out. Ah, yes. Stay ten. Keep breathing. Nine, eight, seven. Keep. If you can straighten, try and straighten. If it's bent, it's fine. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Take the left down as your left shoulder. Push this right. Ah, la la. Stay ten. Breathe nine. Eight. I'm sweating like a crazy person. Seven. Six. Nothing new. Five. Three. Keep pushing out. Two. One. You're gonna come forward. As you come forward, inhale. Take your hands. As you take your hands, you're gonna take it onto your thighs. Push. You wanna try and thrust the pelvis forward. Stay five. It's really not sexual. Four. Three, you're working your inner thighs. You have to understand when you're doing your middle split, you want your inner thighs open and your hamstrings and the hip socket. Two, one. We're gonna come forward. As we come forward, we're gonna parallel the feet again. You wanna try and touch forearms onto the floor as much as you can. Keep pushing the knees out. Stay ten, nine. So even if you wanna pulse and come, you can do that. Eight, seven, six. Five, four. Keep pushing the knees back. Three, two, one. You're gonna sit on the floor. Oh my God! You think it's over? It's really not. Hug. Five, almost. Four, three. I should stop lying. It's not almost over. Two, one. We're gonna come into butterfly or badrasan. Inhale, exhale, open. Or badh gunasan, whichever you find comfortable. We're gonna flap. This feels nice. Oh my God! This feels nice. Ten, nine. Eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one. You're gonna take your right hand, place it back. Left hand on the thigh. Inhale, exhale. Push down. Now, as you push down, if this leg comes up, try and push that down as well. Okay. Inhale, exhale. Keep pushing. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Keep breathing with me. Three. Don't breathe. You're gonna die. Just say signs. Two. One. Change. Left hand behind. Right hand on top. Inhale. Exhale. Push down. Stay ten. Again. See this one wants to come up. Keep pushing it down. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Three. Two. One. You're gonna come up. Now from here, you're just gonna get the forehead to your feet so that your back. Will round okay as much as you can. Forehead to the feet. Stay five, four, three, two, one. You're gonna come up. From here, we're gonna work on a little bit of strength. So you're gonna come. Inhale, heel towards your groin as much as you can. Inhale, take your hands up. Exhaling, we're gonna bend forward, almost touching the floor without touching the floor, but one inch off the floor. And you come up, so you should feel this nice uh, tension over here. Two, and up. We're just doing five of these. Three, and up. Try and get the chest to your feet. Four, and up. Last one. Five. Stay five. Breathe. Four. Three. Keep lengthening. Two. One. Release. As you release, either get the chest to your feet or the forehead to your feet, whichever is comfortable. Stay five. Four, 
breathe three two one we're gonna roll up as we roll up we'll hug say five as we hug we're gonna do almost i promise now almost over three two one you're gonna take in the right foot turn now janu shirsasana c you're gonna take the left in as you get the left leg in now wherever you're comfortable okay so i'm gonna reach out inhale exhale inhaling i'm going to go to the side as i go to the side if this is enough for me you're going to stay if you feel like y'all can go a little low go a little lower the idea is that if your hand touches your feet your body should not be in this position because you want to try and twist and open now as you twist hold on to your opposite knee and then open further so that you feel a stretch yes on the lower side but you're also twisting to open out stay five uh, breathe four the sweat that is coming over is so attractive right now three two one three as you change you're going to change legs in out again take the hand out inhale exhale inhaling you're going to go remember you want to breathe normally try and hold on to your opposite as much as you can again do not shrink in your elbows down lift up and reach stay five feel a nice stretch on my lower back 4 3 2 one inhaling come up 2 3 release now we are going to be doing frog almost now this is the last one before we do the split now as you do a frog we're going to open the knees out okay the first thing as we open the knees out we're going to just get the pelvis and get the feet back and we're going to just sit stay ten Eight, seven, six, five. If you can open more, try and open more. Four, as much as you can. Three, two, one. We're gonna come forward. This is the fun part. As we come forward, inhale, exhaling. We're going to move the body forward as much as we can. Now, as we move the body forward, you want to try and make sure your pelvis touches the floor. Eventually, gradually get the knee on the floor. You want to try get pelvis. Inhale. We're going to move this forward. Exhaling. We're going to try touch the stomach and relax. Breathe. Stay tight. Oh, this is so comfortable right now. Nine. Keep breathing. My sweat is everywhere. Eight, seven, six. You can relax your hands wherever it is comfortable. Five, four, three. If you can get the heels on the floor, great. Two, because you are still working on your inner thighs. One. You're going to get your hands next to your chest. As you get your hands next to your chest, we're going to inhale, lift up to almost like a bhujangasan. Roll the shoulders back. Keep pushing the pelvis on the floor as much as you can. Stay ten. <laughs> Breathe nine. It's a little intense. Eight, seven, six, almost five, three. Two, one. Exhaling. Come down. As you come down, breathe. I promise this is almost. Stay five. Last series. If your legs start shaking, it's great. You're working your muscles. Two, one. We're gonna come up. As you come up, you're gonna release the legs, parallel the legs. As you parallel the legs, you're gonna drop. Oh my God. Um. the opposite leg to the same legs to the same side okay just drop you're going to hold as you hold you're going to just push it down so even if you can't touch your legs right now if there's a rope anything you can do that as well and try and bind and just push down feel a stretch on your inner thighs three keep breathing two one we're going to roll up now from here you're going to come up however you feel like we're going to go into a split so all we're going to do is we're going to be sitting as we sit going to take the legs forward as you take the legs forward you're going to open up to wherever wherever it is comfortable for you and we're going to come inhale exhale inhale exhale we're just going to move forward and back if you feel this is too much just stay four you realize that all of right now your uh, inner thighs have opened your hips have opened so it feels a little better three 
one now if you find this is comfortable stay here we're almost going to do the same thing but you're going to take your hands up now i'm going to show it to you in profile okay so don't go to your maximum uh split go slightly maybe a little bit where you would be comfortable okay and where you're because we're going to be using strength in here take your hands up exhaling we're going to bend forward one and you're going to come back two and back and back four and back once you start feeling a little bit comfortable you can keep opening your leg to where you find it a little bit more challenging almost one and oh i said one we're going to stay here five keep lengthening four three two one release now as you release you want to try and open the leg up a little bit more if you can and stay Forward, so you have an understanding. Inhale, exhale. If you are here, stay here. If this is as much as you can stay, eventually, gradually, you will come lower. You will come lower. You will come lower, and then you will get four arms on the floor. Eventually, you will take the hands forward, get the chest on the floor. From the chest, you will get your belly on the floor. From the belly, you will get your pelvis on the floor. I promise it works like that. Inhale, exhale. But you need to put in the effort so that you can see the changes. Inhale, exhale. Last one. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale down. Stay ten. <sighs> Breathe nine. Try and lengthen as much as you can. Eight. Seven. Six. The knee should not be falling in. Keep trying to push the knee up towards the ceiling and flex the feet towards you. Four. Three. Two. One. From there, you're gonna come up. Whatever you want to see next, uh, how to do whatever, uh, comment below so I can see and I will know what you're going to see next. Um, if this has helped, give it like you know those things which are called thumbs up and shit like that. Not shit like that, but anyway, <laughs> things like that. Uh, till I see you next time. Practice daily. Stay safe. Stay humble. Goodbye.